Okay, so over here we have a pair of transmitter and receiver. We are going to put different products in between and we are going to see whether the signal received here will be blocked or not. Let's put the sticker here. So and the value is around the same. What does that it mean? Means it doesn't affect the signal quality over here. It doesn't work. So let's put this thing here. And the reading is still around the same. Yeah, no significant difference at all. It doesn't Nothing offer different. any kind of protection. So it's belly armor, but it's not belly good. For babies to wear to help keep their heads protected. Oh, that's some effect. So it went down from minus 25 to minus 31. Is that a significant drop? I think as we can see from the label of this baby cap, there's some metallic material that reflected the signal. So it works in a similar way as this metal plate. If I put it here, you see the signal power drops significantly. Ah, okay, so, so essentially it's putting a metal in between yes. the signal and you. Yes, correct. So it was around 25 to begin with, and again, no change? No change. Okay, so this doesn't work too. All of them are within the safety limit, so it shouldn't be a concern. But for people who are still concerned about radiation, they can reduce the amount of time they're using their phone, maybe shut it off at night, and use a speaker mode while making a call. This increases the distance between you and your phone. And then all these are simple measures which can reduce RF exposure. So I've been worried about you know, radiation in my home and, and wondering if I can you know, figure out just how safe it is. Yes, uh, we can do that, Steve. I have okay. brought this instrument called as the spectrum analyzer. Okay, great. Let me bring you to my favorite spot. I want to see how safe that is. Sure. 